When I'm 64. And when I'm 64, folks, you can bet I'll grow a mustache just like this, you know, where you put a little wax on the end of it. Pretty slick, huh? What you are witnessing is the brass mustache attack. I'm Kurt Thompson, TrumpetSizzle.com, and I'm bringing you another review of kind of a cool item. Whether you wanted to make a few videos when you're younger, Actually, even if you're a girl, I think this would be pretty hilarious to put this on where you're, you know, playing a couple of solos. Um, so it came in this box here. And the one I got was for trombone, but I just put it across my sleeve and it worked. So um, I, I think that, um, well, the trumpet would work. They have one for trumpet. I'm, I'm not sure if they have one for French horn. Uh, this one here is for bone. I bet it probably would almost fit a tuba. So, um, it's the brass mustache. And what we don't do. I'm um, having that old, an old book that I had from a long time ago that I don't even really work out of anymore. Uh, I wonder what this one goes like. Ah, no, I don't like that one. Um, that's probably the one at the back of the book here. Supposedly it's the hardest one. I'll just do a little bit of it. If I can see it here. There we go. Okay. Especially over the holidays or at a birthday party or uh, maybe you want to shock your band director <laughs> um, I think you you can see where I'm going there's a lot of ways to use this for good and also for evil <laughs> I'm not telling you to um, don this at one of your most important band concerts of the year and uh, while you're playing, uh, I'm not telling you to do that. Um, you didn't hear that from me. So you can see that the brass dash has quite a lot of uses. And uh, anyway, just kind of fun playing around with it. I got it on Amazon. I'll leave the link where you can get it right now in the description. I'm Kurt Thompson. I will catch you in the next one, my friend, without the brass dash. <laughs>